Computers come in many shapes and sizes. All of them have the same components in common, generally speaking, so let's take a look at some of those. First is the computer itself, the part that does the actual computing. It used to be you could refer to this part of the computer as the tower, but nowadays this main part of the computer can come in so many different forms that we need a more general word. We'll refer to this part as the CPU. Now, CPU stands for Central Processing Unit, and it's worth noting that this also refers to the actual processor chip inside the computer, but it's a common way to talk about the whole computer itself too, so that's what we're going to call it. The CPU does all of the heavy lifting, and it has a bunch of ports on it that allow you to connect different peripherals to it. We'll talk about connector types in a minute. First, let's look at common peripherals. We have the keyboard, which lets us type and use shortcut keys. We have a mouse that lets us move a pointer and click on stuff. And of course we have the monitor. There are lots of other peripherals too, like printers, scanners, external hard drives, external microphones, web cameras, and much more. In the next section, we'll take a look at how they all connect to the CPU.